Hi everybody, AJ Tutorial 64 here with another video. Today I will be reviewing Grace Thomas's collection from American Girl Doll. She is the girl of the year 2015 and I've seen her collection before, so I kind of know everything that I want to and how and what my opinions are. So I hope you guys enjoy and disclaimer these are my opinions and I understand if you disagree. So please no hate, but I hope you enjoy the video. So this is Grace Thomas and she reminds me a lot of McKenna. People say she reminds um, them of Krissa, but I think she looks a lot like McKenna with her lips and her long hair. Um, but... There are things different about her, like her bangs and her freckles, and that is what's a little tweaked about her, as well as her outfit, of course. I don't, I'm not really a fan of her outfit. It's a lot of pink for me, and there's a lot of bows and things that are incorporated that just don't really fit my style, like, um, just so much pink and bows and hearts, and I don't really want a doll who just looks like she was thrown up in bows and hearts, and her entire collection is kind of like that, so that's what is just kind of getting me on this collection, um, so yeah. So I really like the style of her coat. But I'm not really a fan of the color, nor the boots she's wearing, and I am totally aware that those are the boots that she comes in, and I just don't, I'm not a fan of them that much. Um, but this whole collection seems a little cheap for me with the color scheme, and you'll hear me talk about that later and how this entire collection reminds me so much of our generation. So this is one thing that I actually like from the collection, and I love the pink and the ruffles and the style of it. Um, I think that the headband is a little weird, though. It's just like a giant poof. But this is one thing in her collection that seems um, not kind of um, cheap. This seems like American Girl doll high quality. Um, something very nice and that I would love to purchase. To be honest, when I first saw this outfit, I was like, what the heck? I was like, what is that? An apron? A dress? I was like, what the heck? I just Ugh, I don't like this outfit. The colors doesn't really match. It reminds me of our generation again. Not high quality, all that stuff. Um, it, it's kind of weird for me. Um, and I don't really, I couldn't see my dolls wearing it. It looks a little childish to me. Something that a little kid would wear. Um, something that I just doesn't seem like American Girl doll would make. So I really do think that this outfit is adorable. I love how American Girl doll made it modern and something that girls um, would wear. Very modern. Um, but the love across the chest just doesn't appeal to me. Her pajamas remind me of Jess's pajamas, Girl of the Year 2006. I like the style of them, but I'm not really, I don't really like the pants and the words on them. And again, there's a lot of bows in this outfit that I don't really like. So I really like the style of this. Um, it, but it reminds me a lot of our generation with the color and the, um, just the red and the blue and the black, I don't like it. I don't think it mixes. I think it looks cheap. I think it looks like something American Girl doll wouldn't make because of the weird colors. And I feel like if they went with different colors, they could have made such a huge drastic change in this 
collection. I know some people like it, but I think it looks a little cheap. And her whole, all of her furniture is like this, which is a little sad. And then something that I would do if I was making this is add another chair because it's kind of awkward for just one doll to be sitting at a table alone by herself. So, yeah. This for me just adds to the whole Our Generation look. As well as this. So when I first saw this piece, I was like, holy cow, that's huge, that's amazing, that's so cool. But then I got to look at it more, and I really don't like it. I feel like for American Girl, it lacks detail and um, kind of the thing I was talking about earlier about not being high quality. It kind of looks like cheap American uh, or cheap our generation stuff. And I feel like the color choices were awful for this. I feel like the outside is ugly, um, at least the color. And then the blue doesn't add to it. And I feel like with more um, detail, like maybe some trim around the, um, f by the floor or more buttons near the stove or stuff, would have made this... Uh, what is it, a bakery? So much better. So that is my opinion on Girl of the Year 2015, Grace Thomas. And I do know that so many people love this collection and the doll, but I will not be purchasing her um, for myself. So leave what you guys think about this collection below, and I'd love to hear. And I hope you enjoyed this video. And again, no hate towards opinions, please. Thank you.